Check out these adventures. Good morning, Mason. Morning. Happy Monday. He is in school right now. He's listening to a lecture. I think an ELA lecture. It's Monday. We're up. Tired. I don't know what from. We really didn't do anything over the weekend. But Mondays are still Mondays. Um, yeah, so another week of online schooling for Mason. And I don't know. What we what do we have planned? We are going into Easter this weekend. So this vlog goes up on Saturday. So tomorrow is Easter for you guys. So happy Easter. Hope you guys are enjoying your Easter weekend. Um, yeah, just another week. Mason has online schooling. And then we're going to try to get some training in for him. I just talked to Jack. I know he wants Mason to maybe go on for a, like a couple yeah. runs this week. Trying to get his cardio back up. That way when we do start playing basketball, he's not sluggish. And his cardio is where it needs to be. I um, guess that's all I got for now. I know Mason needs some breakfast. So I think I'm going to help him out and make him some breakfast while he's finishing listening to his lecture. But it's a new week. Happy Monday. The art project has begun. What do you guys think he's gonna draw? It's your first clue. How are you gonna do on this project? Bad. <laughs> Good luck, bud. Try your best. Still working on that art project over there? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's looking good. He's getting ideas from his phone and transferring that to his little uh, project he's got going there. Um, I did get some comments, people asking about Mason's um, history or what we call social studies. Um, he has that this week. The way his school works is he um, alternates science. So last week he had science, this week he'll have social studies. So he did have social studies. In fact, he took a break from his art project and did an assignment and he thinks that he got five out of five on it. So I'll just have to wait for the grades to come in. But just to answer some questions that I was seeing on my DMs and stuff, there you go. He has social studies this week. Should I show him a sneak peek of what you're drawing there or should we wait? No. Just wait? Okay, we'll wait. Hello, Mason. Goodbye, Mason. Bye. Hello, Jack. Goodbye, Jack. They all just left me. No. Jack is I'm moving. <laughs> Jack's moving a car. He just got back from a run. Mason looks like he's heading out back to possibly play some, oh, yep, yeah, yeah, okay. Looks like he's going to play some baseball. And I am actually getting dinner ready. Jack has been requesting um, chicken teriyaki. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the rice started and then I think I'm gonna do the chicken in the Instant Pot and I have some easy teriyaki sauce. Unfortunately, I won't be able to eat that dinner tonight because there's gluten in the teriyaki sauce but I have some leftovers from over the weekend that I can heat up. That's gonna be dinner tonight. <laughs> Doing that baseball, basketball crossover. <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Just go for the dunk. Buckets! Wet. Ready, plus up. <laughs> Alright, see it. Okay. Finished product. Hopefully, Jack likes it. Hello, everyone. Happy Tuesday. Mason. Yeah, you guys, he started watching Spongebob again yesterday, but school's done for the day, right? How'd that go? Fun. Good? I ended at like 10, so pretty much an hour. Yeah, his school day wasn't as long as normal because he didn't have a school lecture this morning. He logged on and realized, oh, there's no lecture today. So that was time saving. But Mason, come here. Mason has been asking me to make See if I can get it to focus. Spicy buffalo cauliflower bites. Because his Aunt Tiffany makes them and he's had them before at her house. We've never made them at our house, but we've got all the ingredients laid out. You gonna help me? Yep. All right, try new things. 
here we go. I mean, because cooking with a basketball in your hand and watching SpongeBob in the background is just the way to cook in the Bevo house. Ready? Ready. <laughs> You're so funny. We chopped up our um, cauliflower. All right, now I gotta mix that, right? Mason's been making the batter, so I think we're making the batter, and then we are going to put that in there, and then roast it, and then I believe we're gonna put the hot sauce and butter on, and then we'll roast them again. But you probably get a spoon instead of doing the shake, shake, shake. Just, just an option. All right, they're all coated. So Mason's gonna put them in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes. And I do believe while we're waiting for the first round, are you gonna go out into the garage and hit? He's already got the bonnet set up, ready to go. Go ahead, don't be scared. It's just an oven. Just don't touch anything or you'll get burnt. Top or bottom? Um, the middle rack, the bottom. <laughs> just don't touch anything. There you go. Good. Okay, now set the timer. Just do 15 minutes and we'll check on it. Oh, geez. Oh, you started the microwave. Oh boy. Cancel, cancel, clear, clear, clear. There we go. All right, you have fun hitting in the garage. Okay. Look, he's focused. How do you have 15 seconds? 15 minutes. You just did it. Oh, you did. How do you do what did he minutes? do? Timer. Fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes. Oh, I start. Press the zero. Right. Okay, we got it now. We got it now. So I will clean up all this while you go hit. Deal? Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Well, I was gonna hit before this, and you're like, we should probably do this before. Well, because it's so. lunch time and. I didn't want to eat lunch at like two o'clock because these are going to take about an hour. Why? Your timer is about ready to go off. But how about you continue to hit and mom will do the second step. Deal? All right, and then back in the oven for 20 to 25 more minutes. Perfect timing. You just got done hitting and the timer went off. What do you think? They smell good? How'd you do? <laughs> Might be hot though, be careful. You sure you don't want any ranch? Yeah? Mm -hmm. All right. The only thing I recommend guys, although it's coming off pretty good, but um, maybe parchment paper next time, but I think it's gonna clean pretty easy. Still cooking in the kitchen? Look at you, you're gonna become a little chef after our quarantine. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Perfect. It's milk, making a milkshake or a smoothie, something like that. What are you making? Smoothie? Smoothie. Family needs a little fuel. We're gonna bust out that new birthday cake creamer. I think Mason's going to make an iced coffee. No worries, it's decaf, guys. That, and then a bike ride. Oh, you're gonna make caramel? Ooh, okay. I do have some whipped cream, but it's dairy-free whipped cream. Okay. What is it? Dairy-free whipped cream. Oh, it's like made out of coconut milk or something. I'm just kidding. It's fine. Um, but Jack's home. Hey, Jack. He's getting the vlog ready for you guys for tomorrow. But Mason, what day is it? What's for dinner? Tuesday. Oh. Oh. Tuesday. <laughs> so bike ride and then tacos. Hello everyone, Mason's out back. It's actually a beautiful day. <laughs> he just did some kind of dance. Don't mind me, I'm still coming down from, I went for a run today. And I feel like today is getting nicer as the day goes on because this morning, my run, it was so hot. Definitely getting hot out. Let's see, it says it's 77 out. But it's Wednesday, Mason's got school done for the day, although I think he's gonna work on his art project at some point a little bit more today. Um, it's definitely lunchtime. I just asked Mason if he wants a BLT sandwich and he said yes please, so I think I'm gonna work on that while he does a little bit of baseball outside. Looks like he's also talking to his friend. 
his friend that lives in California. You guys know him, Nathan does vids. Um, they've been hanging out, FaceTiming, playing video games during this whole quarantine thing, um, motivating each other. Although California just got a lot of rain, so he hasn't been able to go outside. So he's probably jealous that Mason's outside playing baseball right now. But um, we're supposed to be getting that rain, but now they're saying only 20% chance of rain. So I don't know if we're gonna get it or not. How did school go today? Good, it was easy. It took me like an hour to start reading. Alright. You gonna work on your art project though? Uh, I don't know. I might do it tomorrow. Tomorrow, okay. Alright, I'm about ready to start dinner. I don't know if you guys can hear it. Well, you just quit. Mason's outside, or in the garage, doing um, a basketball drill. He's got a basketball and a tennis ball. Trying to stay in shape. Speaking of that, Jack's out for a run. Um, but it is dinner time, so I'm gonna go ahead and start some dinner. Today's dinner is going to be a little meatloaf, turkey meatloaf. And I have salad to go with it, and maybe some mashed potatoes. And I think I'm gonna try to do some carrots in the Instapot, another recipe that I found today. So while they're doing the workouts, I'm gonna get to dinner. I wish you guys could smell that because it smells amazing. But there's the finished product. Looks good. Dinner's ready. Good morning, Mason. Happy Thursday. We almost made it to the weekend. He's getting school done. He has. To, are you gonna do it right now? Yeah. Big math test. Yep. All right. Good luck. Do your best. You done? Yeah. Done with art class? Yeah. All right, Kitchen Island turned into art class. First of all, how'd you do on your math test? Oh, I'm good. Got 50 out of 50, but he said it was easy. It was only like 15 questions? Yeah. Awesome. You're like, how are you done so quick? I was like, it's... I know, I just like, assumed that it was gonna be 50 questions long. I was... No. Okay. It was only like 15, and then like, there was like all, like besides like three of them, all of them were like true or false, or okay. yes or no questions. So not too so bad. Those are easy. All yeah. right. You ready to show off your art project? Oh, sure, yeah. Okay. Guys, don't make fun of him. He has admitted that he's not good at art, but I think it turned out great. So what was the project? It had to be a character? Well, we were doing like watercolor paint. Which we don't have watercolor, so we had to go to plan B. All right, you guys ready? You worked hard on it. And he, he hand drew or free drew everything. Bam! I think it turned out great. The only thing he used was a, a bowl to get the perfect circle. And then half of a bowl to get these lines perfect. But everything else, even, I mean, come on. I think that's amazing. He struggled with the shoes, but I think they turned out great. Clouds look good. So he can turn it in. And this was his little setup. He was practicing his clouds, like what he thought looked good. Checking colors that he wanted to use. Well, good job, Mason. I give you an A plus if I was your teacher. What do you guys think? Not too bad? Not too bad. You wanna explain what you got going on here? So I saw this TikTok and um it said it like tastes like almost like a vanilla bean, like Starbucks drink. Okay, like a so frappuccino, frozen. Like a vanilla bean, pretty much. All right, so he's got all of his ingredients so. out. That's a lot of sugar. No wonder why Starbucks so good. We've got milk, ice, vanilla. Is that it? And you just put it in the blender? Yeah. What do I do first? The ice, probably. Sure. Stay tuned. Um, Okay, he's got everything in there. Wait, blend on high? Blend on high. Okay. Moment of truth. Hopefully it just tastes good. I hope so. Whoa. Is it good? It is good. He left me a little bit, so I guess I can try. Yum? Yeah. All right. We still have nets, sort of. Got rain. 
hands. Yeah. Dinner time. Simple, fast, easy dinner. Hello everyone, happy Friday. We made it to the weekend, Easter weekend. I'm super excited. I'm also super proud of that kid over there. You guys, I found a new running partner. We ran two miles today. In fact, he took his social studies test, did pretty good on that, and then we went for a two mile run. So I'm super proud of him. And now we're starving, so I'm making him an omelet, soon to be omelet there. We got some strawberries on the side, some potatoes left over from last night's dinner. Get some protein, some food in the bellies after our run. But super proud of that guy. I know it's gonna pay off when he gets back to basketball and he's been running and putting in work. So, how you feeling over here? Tired? <laughs> A little sweaty? Let's see the sweat. Oh yeah. How's it going over there? Mason's watching some YouTube. Jack. Six feet apart. Playing the show. Six feet apart. Yeah, we're hanging uh -oh. we're hanging out in ja uh, Mason's loft and I just asked him, are you ready for this to be over so you get your loft back? Do you like hanging out with your mom and dad? <laughs> yes, you do. You love your mom and dad. <laughs> Uh, but it is Friday night. You guys know the drill. I think we're gonna go ahead in the vlog. Let's see, oh my gosh, seriously. Um, dinner tonight is either gonna be pasta or my sister sent me this rice, ground beef, corn, cheesy recipe. So I might do that, some salad. That's gonna be our dinner plans tonight. We're going into Easter weekend. I hope you guys enjoy your Easter. Happy Easter, everybody. But as always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time. <laughs> Ooh, you guys, you know what? Fun fact, Mace, let's see that pillow next year. I believe that was Easter last year. We were at my sister's house. And I think that was Easter. Aw. Somebody sent that to us. Yeah. Don't <laughs> to subscribe. Like this video on the comments in the comment section. And to check that in the sky from awesome Google Adventures. And the Fiber Girl Adventures. And to press the bell down below so you know if I will post the next video. And to check out next time's adventures.